besides being considered an action movie legend. Chuck Norris is a powerful man who has made a lot of money throughout his career. But have you ever stopped to wonder about just how this actor lives? In this video, you will discover what the luxurious life of Chuck Norris is like. Before we get started, I challenge you. You have to click on subscribe and activate notifications check the option all. But you have to do that in less than 5 seconds, you got it? And if you can, write in the comments hashtag about subscribe. Alright, let's get started. Career Born in 1940 in the city of Ryan, Oklahoma, Carlos Ray Norris, better known as Chuck Norris, is a famous action movie actor. He began his career serving in the United States Air Force and later participating in martial arts championships until he started being invited to play small roles as an actor. Alongside his friend Bruce Lee, he acted in 1972 in his first major film, known as The Way of the Dragon. From there, he began to take this new profession more seriously, going on to star in a few films, such as Breaker, Breaker, and Good Guys Were Black. In the 80s, Chuck Norris became one of the main stars of action movies in the world, starring in several films such as Invasion USA, The Delta Force, Code of Silence among many others. In the 1990s, he took the lead role in Walker's television series, Texas Ranger, and also went on to act in many films, such as Delta Force 2, The Hitman and Sidekicks. Starting in the 2000s, Norris began to slow down his acting career, with his last performance being in 2012's The Expendables 2. And because he played several fearless characters throughout his career, Chuck Norris has become a huge internet meme because of his physical strength. Today, Norris is considered an action movie legend, having already made more than enough money to live a super comfortable life. California Real Estate Throughout Chuck Norris' career, he has lived in several luxurious residences. In the state of California, for example, he has lived in a rustic-style residence, north of the city of Tustin. Built in 1977, the main house is approximately 3,900 square feet in size, and upon entering the estate, there is a carefully designed living room facing some glass walls that offer lovely views of the wooded garden. The place has other family rooms, a stone-walled wine cellar and a gourmet kitchen with top-notch furniture. There are a total of five bathrooms, plus four cozy bedrooms, among which is the large master suite, which has a private bathroom. The house also has a recreation room, an office with tiled walls and wooden tables for day-to-day -day meals. Going outside, the tree-filled grounds are almost two acres in size, having a lovely lake with a dock and plenty of colorful fish. There is also a courtyard for relaxing, featuring a jacuzzi, as well as a residential sauna, a lounge area with a fireplace, and a well-kept lawn that is ideal for outdoor events. The external area also has a private road with a bridge near the house, plus other spaces to relax near the lake, in front of natural landscapes that help and bring a sense of well-being. The site even has a saltwater swimming pool and a guest house styled similarly to the main residence. According to some sources, Chuck Norris sold the property in 1989. Since then, it has been listed a few times, for different values. In 2016, for example, he was asking for the price of $3,500,000. The actor also once owned a 2.2-acre property in California, this time located in the Tarzana district of Los Angeles. In a report made on the People channel, they showed the mansion that Chuck owned until 2005, before selling to actor Wilmer Valderrama, who made major renovations to update the residence. There's about 5,000 square feet of area, with its living room having leather sofas and with a large cinema screen, which provides entertainment to the residents, besides having unusual decorative pieces, such as a table made with a boat propeller. The place also has a sophisticated bar with beautiful artistic portraits of Lucille Ball and Desi Arnaz on one wall, while the elegant kitchen in neutral colors features high-end appliances and a large center island that serves both for preparing meals and as a casual dining area. The kitchen integrates a breakfast area, which features a glass table, custom seating and a neon sign on the wall. To go outside, there are large glass doors that open to a recreation area with a resort-style pool, which still features a cozy deck for relaxing, dining al fresco, or enjoying gatherings with friends and family. 
Chuck Norris sold the property in 2005 to Valderrama for $3,525,000, despite listing the place in 2004 for $5,300,000. Cars Despite being private about his personal life, Chuck Norris has been spotted with some pretty hefty vehicles. He has, for example, done commercials for a Fiat Fullback, a beautiful pickup truck valued at around $30,000, although he has probably won this car instead of buying it. Raising the price, Chuck Norris is always photographed leaning against his Ford Ranger, another rugged pickup truck whose newer, full-size models can go for almost $35,000. He has also been seen next to a Chevrolet Avalanche, which since it is customized, can be worth around $40,000. Chuck Norris has also done commercials for a Toyota Tacoma, another imposing 4x4 pickup truck, ideal for tackling any kind of terrain. And it's no wonder that the most complete models of this vehicle can cost around $45,000. Another vehicle he has done commercials for is a Fiat Ducato, a kind of van made for those who need a lot of space. And to give you an idea of price, the newest models cost over $60,000. The most expensive car that Chuck Norris is speculated to own, however, is a fully customized Chevrolet Silverado. This is a gigantic vehicle capable of attracting a lot of attention for its very imposing looks. This huge pickup truck is equipped with a strong engine capable of towing over 36,000 pounds. The interior, on the other hand, is very elegant and spacious, capable of offering great comfort and ergonomics for all passengers. And it's no wonder that the most complete models of this gigantic vehicle surpass the $70,000 mark. Real Estate in Texas When it comes to choosing a place to live, Chuck Norris is a man who likes to live in quiet places with lots of open spaces. He once owned, for example, a large mansion in the Northwood Hills neighborhood of Dallas, in the U.S. state of Texas. The residence was built in 1975, and Chuck Norris lived on the premises during the filming of the Walker, Texas Ranger series, with him co-owning the property with his brother. The venue features some elegant living rooms that have been refurbished in recent years, as well as a spacious kitchen, seven luxurious bathrooms and a formal dining room for ten, which sits next to large glass windows. There is also a family room with piano, a residential gym, a modern media room, a breakfast setting, and other accommodations to pass the time. On the outside, the lot is over 27,000 feet, containing a recreational area with a pool. According to media reports, the star listed the property in 2013 for $1,200,000. Another estate that Chuck Norris owns in Texas is a farm, located on the banks of Hill Country in the town of Navasota. Known as Lone Wolf Ranch, the old architecture home has refined finishes from the main entry door, which is next to some cozy porches that are good for passing the time on a daily basis. There are many amenities inside, such as a classic kitchen with wood cabinets, which features several counters for preparing meals, as well as being next to a large dining room. Chuck's farm also has a huge private museum, where he keeps medals and trophies of championships he has participated in, and records of filming that marked his career. Chuck Norris also keeps objects of important sentimental value at this location, such as his late brother's military uniform. The farm also has a gym with modern equipment, which has a wall with mirrors, not to mention that there is a hall for training martial arts, where the actor helps an institution with the karate training for needy young people. The ranch even houses a 50,000-square-foot bottling plant, which was created by Chuck and his wife. Going outdoors, there is a vast amount of space to go tracking daily, and to get anywhere on the extensive property, Chuck Norris uses military vehicles to make it easy to travel around any time. The property also has a lovely lake, which has a wooden deck for fishing, not to mention there is a large barn, where the star raises beautiful horses. Chuck Norris bought the farm several years ago in order to live with his family in a quiet location, and thanks to the improvements the fighter has made to the property, it is believed that it must be currently worth quite a lot. Sources of Income Today, Chuck Norris is an entrepreneur who has several sources of income in addition to his acting career. One of his biggest ventures is his Sea Force brand of water, which comes from a naturally alkaline aquifer deep within the actor's ranch. He also owns Roundhouse Provisions, a brand of kits of food supplies for times of emergency. 
Chuck Norris also manages to make a good income as a lecturer, managing to charge over $100,000 for a lecture. Another source of his income is as a writer, being a best-selling author, with books such as The Secret of Inner Strength, My Story in Black Belt Patriotism, How to Reawaken America. One of his biggest sources of income is through his image, because Chuck Norris is known worldwide as a symbol of strength and courage, which ends up attracting the interest of several brands to make commercials with him, such as the car manufacturer Fiat, the arms manufacturer Glock, the telecommunications company T-Mobile, the Polish bank BZWBK, and the fast food chain Hesperger. However, he also manages to earn quite a bit of money through his social media. On his Instagram, for example, he has over 400,000 followers, and on his Facebook page, almost 7 million people. These are places where he takes the opportunity to promote his own products and also advertise for other companies, like for the Total Gym Sports Equipment, the online game World of Tanks, and the clothing brand GoTai. And as if that wasn't enough, he has even launched his own online mobile game, all inspired by his image as a tough guy in the movies. With all this, we can say that although he is no longer acting, Chuck Norris still continues to have good sources of income. Net Worth Being one of the most well-known action movie actors of his generation, it's no surprise that he has made a lot of money throughout his career. But things weren't always that easy. It's estimated that he was only paid $10,000 in his first starring role in Breaker. Breaker! From then on, his salary grew as his films started to become successful, and his name became more and more known in the film industry. To get an idea, it is estimated that he received about $40,000 for Good Guys Were Black, $125,000 for A Force of One, $250,000 for An Eye for An Eye, and up to $500,000 for The Expendables. But it was in the series Walker, Texas Ranger that Chuck Norris really made money. This is because some sources estimate that he started out getting paid $100,000 per episode and that over time it increased until it reached $375,000. And adding up all the episodes over the course of eight years, it's estimated that he got paid the small grand total of $33 million. However, adding up all of his sources of income over his 50-plus year-long career, many sources estimate that Chuck Norris currently has a net worth of approximately $70 million, an amount that is more than enough for him to retire. Hey, you like the video? So don't forget about leave your like and comment, and tell some suggestions of another videos, and hopefully we gonna do it. All about channel, deals to satisfy your curiosity.